The most comprehensive study of general aviation safety is about to be released to the world. The 27th annual NAW report will be published on Friday. But we have an advanced copy and the news is very good. This latest NAW report had a, a double good news whammy in that uh, on the one, uh, flying activity increased in 2015 by almost 4% up to about 24 million flight hours across general aviation and fatal accidents went down. So while we're flying more, we're having fewer fatal accidents and all that means that another record setting year of uh, our fatal accident rate, which is down to 0 0.84 per 100,000 flight hours for 2015. 2015, because the NAW report is an in-depth analysis of NTSB accident reports, and it takes up to two years for most of those reports to be completed. The NAW report is what the aviation industry uses to focus its safety improvement effort. And then we as an industry take that and go figure out how we make things better through better training, better proficiency, better technology, and then, um, of course, the culture associated with, with how people fly in the environment they fly in. So where are the problem areas? Well, as in the past, pilots themselves could make general aviation even safer. Some 75% of accidents are still due to pilot error. Now, the good news is that percentage, or that percentage has stayed relatively stable. But the good news is the raw numbers of those accidents are down uh, this year. So the raw numbers are going down but I'd still like to see us reduce that percentage. Loss of control, particularly on takeoff and climb out, continued VFR flight into instrument conditions, and surprisingly, running out of fuel are the most common causes of fatal GA accidents. We are still seeing uh, fuel management issues. If we were to look at you know, one area that I would just like to see us eliminate from the NAL report, um, it just boggles my mind that we're still seeing people run themselves uh, out of gas. So still plenty of work to be done. There is. I mean, we're doing the same things over and over again. Yeah. At least the numbers are going down, but we still have a lot of work to do. Yeah, the, and the whole fuel exhaustion thing is just uh, incredible. We're losing about one airframe a week because of um, fuel exhaustion accidents. Uh, so anyhow, there's a lot to be done. Uh, November issue of AOPA Pilot Magazine, I've got a piece coming up that we, where, we, where we address that and talk about some uh, technology solutions that can help make it better. Good. We'll look forward to that.